Yes, you read that right. That if you're an MBA student, then most likely the choices which you're about to make or which you have made already are influenced by fame that you want to become famous and not rich. Now this might sound slightly counterintuitive, but in this video, I help, you know, I'll help you to stop, pause and introspect that how probably a lot of choices about your life and about your outcomes from the MBA are more influenced by how famous you can be instead of how rich you can become. And there you might find that yes, if you're truly somebody who's influenced more by fame, then you might be in a bit of a problem because that might be a short lived experience. Hi, I'm Dapan Saxena, an MBA graduate from IIM Udaipur and let's get on with the video. Now what I'm speaking to you about is one very simple thing and probably over the next 5 to 8 minutes you will be able to pause and reflect that whether the choices you are about to make are they about the fame which you can have from that or about how rich you can become and you being an MBA student, it's very important for you to think about it right now because the kind of choices which you make right now are gonna have a very big impact on the kind of outcomes which you get from your MBA. Now what I'm speaking to you about is this, that it could happen for example that the kind of job role or the kind of organization which you are aiming for in your MBA you could be aiming for that job role or that organization only and only because of the fact that they help you get famous. So for example, I know of a lot of students who aspire for consulting and prod man jobs when they are in their MBA program. And when you ask them why, then you and they would realize that yes, probably consulting a prod man is not what they really want, but they aspire for it and they strive for it only because of the fact that their friends and the entire campus is dying to get those jobs because it is fancy and fashionable to get that job. And hence, if you as an MBA student can get those jobs, which everyone else wants then surely you will be famous so having said all of that having having shared with you that example probably now it's time for you to pause and reflect that whether the career choice which you're choosing is it about fame or is it about you truly becoming rich now i'll give you a few more examples to it and by the way if up till now you have been able to understand what i'm saying do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel so that i can bring to you more such content now i'll give you more such examples and a very small example of this which is not about the outcomes from your mba or it is actually is that when you plan to date somebody on your campus then probably even the choice of who you feel attracted to is about fame so for example if you're somebody who's attracted to that place comer out there then probably you need to pause and reflect that whether i am truly attracted to that place comer because he or she is genuinely a good human being or whether it is only about that he or she is a place comer and it's very attractive and it's very impactful and it's very powerful to be associated with a place comer now this you know if you really get the understanding of what i'm trying to say through all of these examples if you really feel that what i'm trying to say then it might save you from a lot of wrong choices which you might make during your mba and hence right now when you are an mba student or even if you're an mba aspirant then probably this entire interaction with me can actually help you a great deal now you might also be interested to know that when i'm saying that you as an mba student do not want to be rich then what exactly am i really implying and what exactly do i mean by the word rich now when i am talking to you about the word 
rich i am implying that how you can become rich in terms of your knowledge rich in your skills and rich in the wealth which you accumulate after your mba that is the kind of rich which i am speaking to you about and if your choices are aligned more aligned towards being rich than being famous then you might save yourself from certain choices which you might regret in the future but here is what the problem is that even if you are somebody who feels that no all the choices which i you know which i intend to make are about being wealthy and they are not about being famous they are about being rich then probably again you need to stop you need to really you know stop and introspect that whether it is truly the reality or not because probably the reality is you want to be rich enough so that you can afford the things which can help you be famous i will repeat that statement that probably even if you think that you're somebody who is trying to make a choice which will help you become rich then probably you want to be rich enough only so that you can afford the things which can eventually make you famous i'll give you a very small example of this that okay some of you may say that no i truly aspire for a consulting job because one of the facts is that it will help me earn a lot but then again just stop and introspect that it could be that you want a consulting job only because you can earn enough so that you can spend on things which you can then upload on your instagram and hence your aim is eventually to become famous your aim the thing which you are really hungry for is the fame which you will get on your instagram after you can upload all of your experiences which you have from your fancy job hence that is another level of what you need to be very mindful of so i hope that you have completely understood what i'm trying to say to you that probably a lot of you a lot of mba students are not aspiring to be rich but you are only aspiring to be famous and it is my responsibility to remind you that probably your goal needs to become rich rich in terms of the skills rich in terms of the knowledge and rich in terms of your wealth now i agree that it is still a human tendency to want to become famous but what if i can advise you that there are other ways to get that fame now what happens is that you are aspiring for fame just fame like straight away but how about if you aspire to become truly rich then probably because of that fact you can eventually become famous so i'll give you an example that if suppose there is a guy and no one speaks to that guy okay however he invents something amazing he you know he invents a very amazing product and that product starts to sell like crazy and from there he starts to earn a lot of wealth and now because of his creation and his invention and the wealth which he or she has been able to accumulate now he also has the fame now is this the kind of fame which you be you know which you would be interested in or is it just the fancy fame which you would want to have without having the wealth i am sure that probably your inclination is to first build the wealth first to build your riches and then thanks to all of that wealth you would want to become famous and the only way to get the wealth is by being of service to someone else hence if you were to ask me that what are the three steps to build your wealth as a student i would say one simple thing that these three steps are learn do and teach which means that first you need to acquire the skills you need to learn the skills and you need to acquire the gyan from there you need to apply those skills onto real world 
projects and you need to apply them onto uh, freelancing assignments or wherever you work now from there the third step is teach that once you have really acquired all of those skills the final step for you is to go ahead and help others to really acquire the same skills now once you complete this learn do and teach then you would realize that the wealth would chase you you would get the wealth surely and that is my advice that is my secret that i would want to share with you about it and if you're really excited about what i've explained then i have an entire community i have an entire series of courses which are around this very thing of learn do and teach the link to my community is in the description do go ahead and enroll for it and i'll see you in another youtube video of mine wherein i'll be speaking to you about something else about your mba outcomes thanks a lot and goodbye